Well, here I am. I'm making my way down to Talbot Square. Uh, where there's a, a protest going on. It's uh, a protest against the mental health cuts in Blackpool. I met the guys on Saturday, the football match. I met Paul who was performing a, a guard of honour. I'm going down this really windy, cold day to film this for you. Apparently Blackpool Council are making cuts to mental health and according to these people that's killing their friends and killing people who need the help in their mental state so it's really really cold. Minds matter, minds do matter and they yeah. need to be able to get fixed in some kind of way. Yeah. What is Star Blackpool? Uh, is Star Blackpool is a peer support mental health service. We yeah. started it basically two years ago now uh, because of the crisis of mental health. We get no funding, we get no help from the council ourselves, we do it all ourselves and we've got over, what, 300, 300 members now? Members. Yeah, and we're going strong. Where are you based? Uh, Claremont Park Community Centre. Um, oh. We're looking at branching out, obviously, because, you know, mental health's not just Tuesday, 12 till 2. Yeah. Um, so we're hoping to get our own building, you know, help people and have it a drop-in centre so you can come in Monday to Friday and get some help that you need. Men, women, everyone over the age of 18 is welcome. Uh, okay. You don't need to refer, you can just come along. Um, and, you know, half of these guys here are our members or our team members as well. So, are we open for Christmas, uh, New Year? We fed, how many can we feed? 25? 25, 25 people on, on Christmas that had nobody where, and nowhere to go to. We had presents for everybody, we had loads of things. Is there any way people can help uh, you? Do you can have... donate, get involved, share, like the page. We're on Facebook as Star Blackpool. So, we've got an open page for people that want to just, if they haven't got mental health, they can join and see what we're up to. We also have a closed page for people to come on if they need to chat 24 7 to someone that's you know if they're lonely or they're on their own or they're struggling but they're shutting down you know the only rehabilitation unit in in blackpool we've also found out they're shutting a children's home and if we don't stand up who's going to stand up that's so that's what we're doing it for well, best of work. thank you very much I'll put you on, I'm, not, I'm not right good in group situations but i'm, I'm, I'm going to start going next there's very little industry here that is um, like year round, it's pretty much all season. Yeah. When you take a, a step back, like a couple of streets back, you see the true war zone that is Blackpool. People try to survive. Yeah. Mental health issues are probably one of the more fatal aspects of this place because we do have a very high uh, drug consumption, we do have a uh, very low income rate. But like you said, with the community side, it's the community spirit holding everything together.